Hey guys, it's your old pal eating good in the woods here with another campground review. This one's going to be a quick one. The reason being, I was not impressed with this place. Y'all stick around, I'm going to show you around. Before we get too deep into this, I'd like to remind you guys, if you haven't done so already, please mash that subscribe button, click the bell icon, leave me a thumbs up and a comment. You'd have no idea how much I'd appreciate that. Okay, moving on, I just want to start off by saying, first and foremost, the opinions expressed in this video are mine and mine alone. I understand that some people prefer different styles of camping and I get that. This was not our idea of camping. Hickory Knob is not a state park. It is actually labeled Hickory Knob State Resort. Now the difference in that is not only does it have a campground, it has an 18 hole golf course, a clubhouse, it has a restaurant, it's got a hotel, cabins, meeting places, and picnic shelters, and a swimming pool. Every bit of that part of this resort is nice. However, it's just not our thing. I go to camp. If this is your sort of thing, this could be your place. But with all that said, as beautiful as they've made this park, it's almost like they looked at the campground and gave it no more thought than Eh, there's some places people can go hook up and camp for the weekend. Eh, <laughs> now I'm sure that's not what they did. There was actually more to the campground than what I could videotape. A bit of it was closed off for the winter, but from the road it didn't appear to be much different than the bit that we did get to look at. Now, the bit that we did get to look at was, well if I'm being honest, there was a couple of places, a couple of spots that looked decent. The rest of them were really rocky, big ruts in them. It just didn't look like it was well maintained. I mean, it's just the way it is. I'm sorry for that, because we are almost always over the moon impressed with South Carolina State Parks. Unfortunately, this one is gonna rank pretty low. Not because of the resort itself, purely because of the campground. It just wasn't up to South Carolina standards, in my opinion. But hey, you know what? That's enough of my yakking. Here's a few details. There's an 18-hole Tom Jackson designed championship golf course on the shores of Lake Thurman. One shag bark snack bar in the pro shop with hot eats and cold drinks. 16 comfortable cabins that sleep up to six people, a skeet shooting range, and one archery range for you and your group to enjoy. Five different meeting spaces for groups of all sizes. There's also a restaurant. 44 campsites located near Lake Thurman. One historic cabin, the Gillibo House, that offers a cool, unique lodging experience for four and a group lodging barrack that sleeps up to 10 people. So that's going to be about it for this episode of Eating Good in the Woods Campground Reviews. I usually try to keep these things nice and upbeat, and I'm sorry I've had to be so negative on this one, but I have to also be honest. So until next time, I love you, God bless you, you guys go out there, be nice to each other. Bye for now.